Hello and welcome to the Ed Hoddle Show. I'm Greg Royce, joined here by Stevenson head football coach Ed Hoddle. And coach, you went up to Delaware Valley last week and uh, they came right out of the gate flying and an eventual loss. Uh, just talk about, you know, overall how the game went. Well, you know, you don't want to start off in a 7 nothing hole eight seconds into the game. So, um, you know, we addressed that you know, in meetings and we've yeah. addressed it in practice that, you know, we need to come out and we need to execute, you know, from play one to, to play 121. So that's been, you know, something that we've talked about and something that we're working to improve upon. Yeah. I mean, overall, I mean, obviously you gave up that and then the punt return touchdown later where the guy was basically down and he somehow, I still don't know how he got out of that. But, um, you know, other than that, I thought you guys played pretty well, especially defensively. You were able to move the ball a little bit. Um, and like we discussed, you played, you know, in some ways a little bit more of a complete game than you've played so far this year. I, I think we did. I think that uh, as you look at our performance, there's flashes of really, really good things, and then we make that catastrophic error. Mm -hmm. uh, I, I, our belief is some of that's youth. Our belief, some of that's focus. Our belief is some of that you know, practice habits that we've got to address and, and continue to work and and really put that full sixty minutes together. You know, we, we get beat on a, on a double move for a touchdown. The, obviously, the, the special teams touchdowns were, were big, and you know we've got to work to really clean up our game mentally as well yeah. as we do physically. Yeah, and also. Um I thought your guys didn't hang their heads after the opening touchdown. Um, you know, I thought they stayed in and battled. And um, was that a positive to take out of the games that they didn't hang their heads? You know, it's easy to to hang your head. You know, going down seven nothing ten seconds in. Sure. Yeah, our guys did a nice job. You know, finishing the game from an effort perspective, and that's that's always a positive. And I think our guys were in a position where they were you know, encouraging one another in a tough situation. And that's always a, a real big positive to see. That's Those are signs to us is, you know, we're growing and maturing as a football team, you know, literally week by week by week. So for us, it, it, it is a positive and, and it's something that we need to build on moving forward. All right, shifting gears. Um, you return home for the first time in a couple of weeks. You host Misericordy on Saturday. This is a team that historically has struggled, but is putting up some points this year and is coming off a win over Wilkes on last Saturday. Much improved football team. Um, I've said it over the last couple of seasons where you can watch the progress. You can see the change in recruiting philosophy. You can see the, the, the schematic problems that they cause opponents. And you can see them growing into a much more mature football team, which is kind of the natural progression of things. So, you know, from our perspective, it, it's going to be a huge challenge on Saturday. Yeah, and obviously you get a lift coming back home, playing in front of the home crowd, um, expecting another great crowd. You just are you guys excited to get back home? I think we're excited. I think uh, you know the last couple of weeks, you know, two tough trips. You know, so it's a situation where it is nice to get home and you know and be able to take care of business in front of our home crowd. Yeah, and finally, obviously after this week, you've got the open week coming up. Um, are you guys looking forward to having that to kind of reset some things and get a little bit of rest? Looking forward to getting healthy. That yeah. that's the biggest thing is is getting our guys healthy. We've got a number of guys that nothing major, yeah. but things that that we've had to hold them out of a out of a game or or limit reps in practice, things like that. That that we can really get those guys off their feet, really get them rejuvenated for the second half of the season. And obviously, I think to the rest part of it, you look at some of our younger players. And, you know, they're struggling with learning how to be college students. Mm -hmm. and, and that's a big piece to, to, to success. And some of those guys we're, we're counting on in game. And to get them kind of caught up on their schoolwork, caught up on the rest, it would be a much needed uh, you know, approach as we, as we look at the bye week. All right, well, thanks a lot, Coach. Uh, best of luck on Saturday. We hope to see everyone here at Mustang Stadium, 12 o'clock against Misericordia. For Ed Hoddle, I'm Greg Royce. This has been the Ed Hoddle Show.